Plum here and welcome agents to this week's look at the secret vendor reset. Before we kick on, make sure you show the channel some love and support, smash that like, share with your friends, and if you're not already, subscribe. Just like every week, to get Cassie's location, you need to find that sneaky cunt, aka the snitch. His spot can be random, but this week I found him outside Final Epiphany Safe House, and then Cassie's location was over at Foggy Bottom. Also, Cassie has an open closed 24 hour cycle, so get your timing right to avoid disappointment. Well, let's see what's on the shelves this week. She has the Culebrae shotgun. Inscription reads, treasure your life, defend it with this. It has premeditated, perfect jazz hands and transmission. Next is the D&H mask, punch drunk. If the first shot doesn't drop him, the second one will, or third. Third's usually good, but it has a good roll of skill power and a low roll of damage to elites and comes with perfect concussion. Then we have the Sleepner. I guess that's how you'd say it. Has perfect frenzy, accurate and stop drop and roll. Along with that, we have some gear set items as well. An ongoing bag, nothing special. Patriot mask, not that great. Hardwired holster with double skill stats. Negotiator's gloves, pass. Tip of the spear knee pads, that's half a percent off max crit chance. Ace's mask, pass on that too. A couple of guns that aren't really worth our funds. Fenris gloves with bad rolls. Alps mask with 39% damage to elites if you don't have one higher. A defensive mod, but the clan vendors got a much better one available this week. And a charges mod for your hive. So that wraps it up for this week agents. Thanks for tuning in. As always, like, share, comment below and subscribe. Plum out.